Now let's turn to David Trim for a look at Adventist history. This week, leadership advice from a former Adventist World Church president. Welcome to This Week in Adventist History, a week notable for events in the Far East and the Middle East. On June 11 in 1882, H.P. Ribton, first Seventh-day Adventist missionary to Egypt, and two Italian co-workers were murdered in anti-Western riots in Alexandria. All Seventh-day Adventists in Egypt were foreigners, and in the shock of the riots and the murders, they all emigrated. There was no Adventist presence in Egypt again until 1898. On June 12 in 1943, Che Tae Hyun, a pioneer Korean evangelist and Seventh-day Adventist church leader, was tortured to death by Japanese military police. Che was probably the first Adventist martyr in Korea. On June 16 in 1966, at that year's General Conference session in Detroit, Reuben R. Figure, one of the most influential GC presidents, announced his retirement. He declared that after 12 years, he had done enough and the church needed new leadership. He ended by recommending to our leaders and to our people the middle of the road, because that is where constructive work is done. On June 16 in 1970, that year's GC session voted to wind up the Middle East Division and create the Afro-Mid-East Division. The action was meant well, but in the end the change of administrative focus served to set back Adventist mission in the Middle East very considerably. That was this week in Adventist history.